Hello there, welcome to today's video and today I'm going to show you an app called Focus, the list app. And um, it's actually a free app, it was a paid app but the devs just made it free. But it's still a full app with no ads or anything. Now when you first launch the screen it looks like this. Um, and you can create lists, tasks and notes and those two that you can see at the moment are lists that I've already created but I'll show you how to make one first of all so you go to the plus sign and um, then you're given a choice either to create a task, a list or a note and as you can see it's really nice and I love the colours and the icons that they've used and I want to um, create a list so I go to list and then you've got to decide where you want it to go, either on your home page, in your home fo list folder or your work folder. And I want to create a new one on the home page, so select home. And then I'm going to do one for shopping. So you just do that. And then you can decide what icon you want, which I, I like this feature, um, where you can choose which one that you want in. So all these different ones here. So quite a lot to choose from. And I'm going to go with the shopping trolley, obviously. And if you want to add more options, you can do. You can add notes, a due date, and whether you want the new items to go to the top and things. So I will do. There's also, if you want to show in a focus list, which I'll show you in a moment. Um, and, but at the moment, I don't want that to go in there. So I'll save that one. And there you've got your shopping list. Now, if you want to put things into your list, you just go into it. And then tap that button again. And we'll create a task. So items that I want. So that's milk. Done save it and it's just simple as that you can just add it um, and it's done that and then you've got your shopping list there um, now if you see here this home one it's actually got a green little star next to it and that is so that it always goes into my focus list it's like a favourites or a, a um, I'd say a top priority list so when I go to that tap on that button there all my own folders there at the top of the button so I don't have to wade through any lists if I had loads and loads of lists that's quite a handy little feature and to go back you just press the home button now when you go into a list so we're going to this one uh, these are the things that are in my folder and this is a task when you've done it you just tap that square and it'll class it as done um, if you want to you can delete any done tasks or mark all tasks as done or move them to the bottom or email them Let's go back and so we'll go back into the work one. As you can see, one's already been done. So if I wanted to clear um, all done tasks, let's clear that away. If I want to add a note, um, I could do. And you just put the title and any notes. And if there's any options as well, again you can put a due date um, and you can show in the focus list or um, and where you wanted it to be created in. And just save it and then as you can see it's saved as a note in your work folder so it's great for um and, well lots of things really it's you're not stuck to and limited to how you've got to have things you can have all different folders and all different notes all in one folder and then same goes for shopping i could have a, a shopping list and i could have another folder in there for things like maybe a christmas list or birthday list all within that shopping folder so it's really good and you can adjust it to however it suits you it does look nice and um, i love the green color that they use and um, it's got the reminders as well which is ideal if you like or if you like me you need reminding a lot and um, you can change if you want badge on your home screen for reminders as well so you can see at a glance what's outstanding so easy to use um, so it's ideal if you're looking for easy to use simple to-do list um, with also reminders as well so let me know in the comments below what you think and thank you for watching bye bye for now